For the last few weeks, the fight between Karnataka and Tamil Nadu over Kaveri water has been reignited. Karnataka has released 5,000 cusics of water to Tamil Nadu as per the directives made by the Kaveri Water Management Authority. Now, Karnataka Deputy Chief Minister D.K. Shivkumar said that the government will be appealing against this in the Supreme Court to reduce the amount of water they've been asked to release. But what are the political repercussions of this kind of a showdown between the DMK and the Congress? Let's take a look at all the reactions coming in first. The Kaveri water war escalates. Karnataka on Wednesday released 5,000 cusecs of water to Tamil Nadu after a directive from the Kaveri Water Regulation Committee. The committee has instructed Karnataka to provide 5,000 cusecs of water every day till September 2nd. The Siddharamaya government facing the anger of farmers in the state claims it is working on reducing the quantity of water released. <laughs> The BJP has slammed the Karnataka government for releasing water to Tamil Nadu. Another 5,000 has been recommended and if they are going to leave it, there will be no left for drinking water and there will be no water left to Kaveri Basin. This will affect the state, um, especially Bangalore and other townships in Kaveri area and the farmers of Kaveri. This is a totally, uh, total mismanagement of uh, Kaveri water. Both Karnataka and Tamil Nadu are unsatisfied with the Kaveri panel's decision. The Stalin government had requested 24,000 cusecs of water, but was given only 5,000 cusecs. Tamil Nadu has approached the Supreme Court to get more water from Karnataka. The court will take up Tamil Nadu's plea on Friday. Bureau Report, India Today.